Governor Nathan Dill realized that there was a gap in terms of our needs-based uh, uh, scholarship. And what we wanted was something that had uh, community buy-in, school system buy-in, family buy-in. So out of that, uh, REACH was born. We're trying to keep our talent in Georgia uh, by offering this scholarship to Hope Eligible uh, Georgia post-secondary institution. It started with staff recommendation um, of students who had great academic potential and academic promise, good behavior, no disciplinary infractions, good attendance, less than five days absence. Application packets went home once they were returned. Then a committee outside of our middle school actually did the selection process. It's wonderful to have students that we can put forth out in the community uh, that are hardworking, focused, goal-oriented, and you know, these are the kind of kids we have here in Pike County, so it, it, it's wonderful to have the opportunity to be able to show the community what kind of wonderful students that they have. I believe another piece that's important to communicate is not only impacting the life of that particular child, but understanding that we're lifting up that whole family. And not only are we lifting up that whole family, but we're uplifting generations within that family. We're putting them on a completely different trajectory, um, which in time can change our whole community. What I love about this program is it's not a top-down program, but it's a grassroots program that's owned by the community. And so you're going to find a myriad of ways that uh, local communities have rallied to support their students. Some will use uh, a, a football game where they'll add a dollar on to the price of a ticket uh, to support their scholars. Service clubs like uh, the Kiwanas, the Lions, the Rotaries uh, will get together and they'll support a scholar. We've had individuals who've named a scholarship. If there's anything in the world that will melt your heart, it's the uh, passion that these young people have uh, towards living a life where they can be successful citizens, hopefully within their own community. The most important benefit they're going to get is understanding the importance of goal setting and perseverance. And we can't ever underestimate the importance of having good coaching and mentoring in a young person's life. Uh, but success starts with having a goal, and a lot of our young people don't learn that until they're young adults. But being able to set goals now, persevere through difficulties, and have mentors to help them along the way is, is going to be beneficial for the rest of their life. Ninth Grade Academy, um, we are the first step into high school, so we monitor kids very, very closely already. Knowing these children, knowing that they have a goal already set and a purpose for high school, we have coaches in place. A lot of people start ninth grade and they don't really have a purpose. Four years down the road seems so far. This gives them a goal. Not only a goal, a financial stability in terms of reaching that goal. This is going to give them light, light at the end of the tunnel. Some students grow up in houses that are different than others. We, we've all grown up in, in different environments. So hopefully this is going to frame their high school experience for them so that they know that the high school, walking across the stage, getting the diploma, the picture, the photo ops, uh, is not the end, it's just the beginning. I'm definitely going to study a lot more. Work harder in classes and try to get better grades. <laughs> keep working hard and staying out of trouble. Uh, do whatever I can to keep the 2.5 GPA and stay out of trouble. I'm going to push myself to get better grades. Thank you to uh, Pike County, uh, the superintendent and the board, the governance team, and all the uh, faculty and staff that uh, uh, have seen the promise of this program and have welcomed us in. Uh, we're just excited that uh, Pike County is in the REACH Georgia family.